Breast milk abortion sequence initiated. Begin Christmas electrolytic time infusion. Is once a year. Every critter ah. holds it dear. Every animal, big or small. Christmas means cold. so much so to cold. us all. It's Danger. Abortion year. access it's slit Christmas stress level. Abortion time. access slit dilated. Initiate control chip removal. Year. It's once a year at Christmas time. When we hear about how Christmas only comes. Wrong once chip. Wrong chip. Ow. Not that. I needed that. Wrong chip. Self-destruction sequence aborted. <laughs> what is it, Mr. Slade? What are you feeling? <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Great job, new kid. But your journey is not yet complete. Yes, but should we ever need your services again, we will call. Great job! You've disarmed the snook! South Park is saved! Yes. Now let's finish this, new kid. Let's beat Clyde once and for all and take back the stick of truth! If you ever want to go back in, just ask. If you want to go take a shower and come back, we'll wait. You're a better man than I, new kid. It'll all be totally worth it when we get the stick back. If you ever want to go back in, just ask. You could conquer the Fortress of Darkness. Clyde, back away from that stuff. Oh, but I have yet to complete my army. You have come to witness the power of darkness. Stop! Clyde, you have no idea what that stuff is! Yeah, it's green sauce from Taco Bell. I took it from their construction site. Dude, that's not Taco Bell sauce. Then why'd I find it at the Taco Bell? It leaked out of a UFO, Clyde. It's toxic goo from another galaxy. Think about it. Since when does Taco Bell have a green sauce, dude? Actually, since about a year ago. What? Taco Bell has green sauce now. No way. They've had it longer than a year. I've always gotten spicy green burritos. Yeah, no, I'm saying in the packets. They just started putting green sauce in packets. The fuck? How the fuck did I miss this? Ha ha! I don't seem so foolish now, do I? That doesn't mean you have Taco Bell green sauce, dip fuck. Yeah, Clyde, why do you think that shit's glowing? Maybe because of the three varieties of chili peppers. Just give us a stick, asshole. Or what? You'll beat me up? Ha ha! I've got another surprise for you. I'm gonna make love to you, woman! Ah! Get him, Commander Douchebag! Let's all make sweet love. Cal! You're straight trippy, kid! I get extra turrets.
children, everybody, I'm back. Enough of this. <laughs> Burn them. Burn them all. Your eons of torment are at an end, ruler of darkness. Uh, okay, um, you know what? I'm not playing anymore. You have broken the rules of the stick, and for that, I banish thee. I banish thee from space and time! Ah! <laughs> we did it, dude! That was awesome. You did it. Your noble quest is at an end. And for all your deeds and all your time put into this, I hereby promote you to King Douchebag. Congratulations! Quickly! Now let's get the stick back to safety before anyone can do. We've got him! We've got the Dragonborn! Dragonborn? What the? What? So it really is the Dragonborn. Just can't stop being a thorn in our side, huh? He has to stick a truth. How does this guy know you, King Douchebag? King Douchebag? Is that what you told him your name was? Why didn't you tell them your real name, Dovakin? You don't remember, do you? How we tried to find you? Look, that stick belongs with the Fighters of Zaron. Give it back. Fighters of Zaron? Boys, what's going on here is much more complex than that. This isn't the first time a UFO has crashed to Earth. You see, in 1947, a UFO crashed in Roswell, New Mexico. Oh, God. Oh, brother, spare us. Hang on a sec. A UFO crashed in Roswell, and a new government agency was created to investigate the paranormal. Our agency. Can we skip this? Like, hit the skip button or something? Oh, you don't want to skip this. Yes, we do. Whenever aliens are spotted, vampires run amok, our agency is there, and we have never lost a fight. That is, until four years ago when we investigated a child. Yawn, yawn, yawn. A child who had an unnatural power inside him. I had orders from the president to secure the child so that we could harness his powers before our enemies could. But he slipped through our hands. The government wants the new kid for his farts? That's dumb. His farts? No. His amazing ability to make friends so quickly on any social network. Before he was five years old, he had 3.2 billion friends on Facebook alone. Do you have any idea the power that kind of gift yields in today's world? It's time to come with us, Dovahkiin. Time to stop resisting and use your gift for your country. Is he really still talking? Are we so different, you and I, Dovahkiin? Uh... You have to do what the government tells you to do, just like me. We're all just pawns in their game. I'll admit you are fascinating. You have more power than any child I've ever come across, and yet all you seem to really care about is this. It must be very important. What does it do? Whoever controls the stick controls the universe, dumbass. Yeah, stupid. Controls the... But then I wouldn't have to do what I was told anymore. I could... <laughs> I control the universe! Get back! Back, I say, all of you! I can do anything, anything I want! <laughs> I no longer need you, new kid! I control the universe! Ah! 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 Damn thing! How does it work? Show me how it works! Yeah, right. Dovahkiin, why should we be on the opposite sides? Join me, Dovahkiin. Rule by my side. Rule. And you can have this all to yourself forever. I can offer you all. Just get me safely out of here. You can rule with this once again. You underestimated the character of the fighters of Zaron. What binds us is more than that relic. And you failed to recognize the character of our alliance. Yes, and that friendship is more important to any of us than even the stick of truth. Dude, where are you going? <laughs> Princess Kenny! At least one of you has some sense. You'd sell us all out? But why, Princess Kenny? Because Princess Kenny was born a half-orc, whose entire village was wiped out by humans and elves. 
Morgan Freeman? You see, when humans and elves lived together in the forest of Hollow Falls, an elven queen fell in love with the orc known as Dandar, the first one to possess the Stick of Truth. They loved in secret and had a child, a beautiful little girl, a girl who watched as everyone she loved was killed in cold blood. And that is why she waited and plotted all this time to take the stick from you, for Princess Guinea is true heir to the Stick of Truth. Wow, that's pretty cute. Just one thing, Morgan Freeman. How come every time something convoluted needs explaining, you show up? Because every time I show up and explain something, I earn a freckle. Ooh, 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 ooh. Princess Kitty, come back here! Welcome! Can I interest you in some of my wares? Can I interest you in some of my wares? Give us a stick, Princess Kenny. You don't want to go down like this, Beth.
We stand together against the darkness! Hit them with the zombie vomit! Make me proud, King Douchebag! I summon the wind! Yes, drink your goo, Princess Kitty! You'll be invincible! Oh no, you don't! For every soul! A start of fire! Show them, Princess Kenyon! Oh, are we taking a break now? Well, what are we waiting for? Use your Ooh. rainbow attack, Princess Kitty! If you kill Princess Kitty, I'll let you hold the stick of truth for a couple minutes. Oh my god! You killed Kitty! Yeah, I'm back! Oh, no, wait, he's back! Death comes for you, Dragonborn. You'd better pray for a miracle. Oh, hamburgers! <laughs> Foolish Princess Kitty. Do you not know that death is a servant of chaos? How can this be? By the moon and the stars and the skies, I swear we will destroy you and chaos energy. One way. We're gonna have to break the gentleman's code. What? Carmen, 
you can't possibly mean. What other choice do we have, Cal? King Douchebag, you remember long ago, I made you swear an oath to never fart on anyone's boss. I am now asking you to break that oath. He's right, it's our only chance. Fart on Princess Kitty's boss, King Douchebag! Do it! Now, King Douchebag, fart on Princess Kitty's boss! What about the gentleman's oath? Finish these weaklings, Princess Kinney! What? We're back to normal. That's right, son. The Dragonborn must have farted on a princess's balls. You guys sure about this? There's no other way. It drove our friend to madness and nearly killed us all. So what do you guys want to play now? How about dinosaur hunters? Or pharaohs and mummies? Let's ask Douchebag. What do you want to play next, dude? Screw you guys, I'm going home. Wow, what a dick.